fish, and Grandma will cook them up. I bet I could eat two whole fish myself. Oh, yeah? Gotta catch them first. Wanna have a contest to see who can catch the most? Okay, I accept your challenge. Unbelievable! Look at all this litter. It's really awful. What a shame. <laughs> Let's go find somewhere else to fish. Wait! We can't leave it like this. If we don't take care of the environment, then who will? So, what's today? Isn't it Wednesday? We won't be done until Friday. Not if our friends help out. Oh, hello. Looks like you've been fishing. But where are all the fish? There's a problem at the lake. There is so much litter. It's gross. We decided we had to do something. But we need some help. What are you two waiting for? Let's get our friends to help. 32, 33, 34, 35, 35. <laughs> Try and beat that. Huh? One, two, five, 45, I won. <laughs> you call that counting? That wasn't fair. What makes you say that? What number comes after 11? That's something like seven, eight? That's what I thought. Bull, it wasn't on purpose. Hi, everyone. We sure need your help. There's a big problem at the pond. Wow. See? Uh, yuck. Don't worry. We'll clean it up. We'll sort it into what's biodegradable and what's not. Food waste is biodegradable, but plastic is not. It's important we separate the two. Bio what? Biodegradable. That means it will break down and decompose. <laughs> Food waste should be collected and buried. And as for the rest, let's place it in the correct bin. Chuck, please put plastic here and glass over there. <laughs> Bull, can you gather the rest into a pile? Uh -huh. Thor, can you dig a big hole? Then you and Unky will flatten it out. Jerry, can you coordinate us from above? But what about me? I want to help too. Once we bury the trash, you can help Unky and Thor level it off. Go, go, Turbozors! All clear! Hey guys, there's one more over on the left! My tires leave lovely tread marks. And that does it. Now Bull can deliver all these treasures to the appropriate bins. Don't forget, plastic and glass go in the recycling bins. Where's Chuck? The pond looks much better. It's time to fish. I thought you two might enjoy a boat, which I made. Chuck, you are a true genius. And all that I needed to construct this boat was one, two, eight, twenty, one hundred and twenty-seven bottles. <laughs> <laughs> Want to have a contest to see who can catch the most fish? I accept your challenge. did a super job. Now it's so beautiful here. Huh? What if people come here and litter again? 
Not to worry. I'll patrol from above, and if I see someone littering, then I'll get this signal to Chuck. You're up, Chuck. Now that ought to make people think twice about littering. <laughs> Joe, Bull, Jerry, Unky, Thor, and Chuck, your Turbosaurus friends. Now they are on funny stickers in Viber. Join our channel and share your emotions with your friends. Today's the last day it's showing. Let's go, sis. Come on, I know you want to see this movie. Sorry, Peter, we can't. There's no way we can go. Oh man, why not? Huh? huh? <laughs> That's our reason. We can't leave Florian alone. <sighs> why, there you are. <laughs> we were wondering where you two were. We're just waiting and waiting. Our grandma had to go into town, so we have to watch Florian ourselves. We have to stay here and can't do anything fun. Hmm. Don't mind <laughs> Mr. Grumpy Pants. He wanted to see a movie, so now he's gonna sulk about it. What if you got someone else to watch him? Who? Well, I'm great with kids, and this tiny human seems comfortable with me. You really think you can watch him for a couple of hours, Joe? Thanks, that's awesome. No, no, tiny human. <laughs> Florian. <laughs> oh, gracious, what now? Are you hiding in my garden? I have your ball. Here you go. <gasps> Florian? Huh? Oh, oh. What are you doing? You could get spotted. I lost sight of the tiny human. Now he's gone. What? Nobody panic yet. Joe, let's go alert the rest of the Turbozoars. <laughs> Florian couldn't have gotten very far. Hmm? Huh. Huh. He's not back there either. He couldn't have gotten into the house, could he? We searched every room in the house, too. We can only hope he doesn't go too far. into the back of Aunt Nora's car. Huh? <gasps> Hang on! We gotta follow them! We should figure out where Aunt Nora's headed. You're right. I think we gotta split up. Chuck, you're great, but you don't have speed on your side. I think you should stay in the forest. You guys get to have all the fun without me. Maybe you should stay here, too. Someone needs to be here in case Grandma comes back before we do. Mm -hmm. Go, go, Turbo Zors! Why'd you stop, Thor? There's a roadblock here. We need to find another way. Uh -huh. Ha, ha, ha. 
monkey, that car. It's the one we need. They'll be so happy. One car delivery complete with tiny human inside. Huh? Guess what, you guys? We found the car that has Florian inside. Oh. We should probably put that back in its parking spot and see if you can fix the flat tire, too. Yes, that's right. I need a new tire. <gasps> or maybe a whole new car? <laughs> Hello? You must help. My car has been stolen. Oh, I guess it hasn't been stolen. And my flat tire's been repaired. What a strange day! What a shame. We've had such a terrible drought. These plants need water. Well, it looks like you're gonna get what you need. Huh? Aren't those rain clouds? Oh, wow. Those aren't just rain clouds. That's a real thunderstorm. Peter, Katie, we should get inside right away. Wait, first I need to collect these apples. Huh? All right, here I come. Don't worry, there's nothing to be afraid of. Thunder is just sound. It's lightning that you should be afraid of. Only because lightning huh? is uncontrolled electricity. Sometimes it can cause a fire. If it strikes something like wood, I learned about it in school. Looks like the rain's letting up anyway. Let's go out. Wait, I see something in the forest that looks like smoke. Where? There, doesn't it look like a forest fire where the lightning struck? Grandma! Forest fire! I'll call the fire department. With just firefighters, can they really put the fire out? Dunno, I don't think they can deal with this on their own. Let's see if our friends can help them out. All right, it's all hands on deck to stop this fire. Putting fires out can be hard. Sure, but nothing is impossible. Here's where the pond is. Maybe we can make a canal, like this. If it goes over this way, we can stop it before it spreads. And what if this canal thing doesn't work? Look, this thing could spread to town. I think we need to warn people. Then you and Joe should go do that. Tell them to be ready just in case of evacuation. dead trees and fallen branches back here. If any of those catch fire, it could be real bad. Chuck, get the branches. Uh -huh. Unky, see if you can collect the bigger lock. How can I help? You can track the fire's path from above us. Uh -huh. One? No, north and west. 
Thank you for telling me. I'll pack a bag and be ready to evacuate. <laughs> a forest fire, you see. Ah, well, it seems my apples will be soon baked. <sighs> Such a shame. Kind thing you're doing warning everyone. Be safe. Thank you. This is just a precaution. Let's hope the firefighters put the fire out soon. as a team. What a shot! Just look at this cinematography! The fire, the smoke, the water! Huh? We did stop the fire, didn't we? No, duh! With your help! Huh? Huh? Hey, the fire department! Quick, before the fire's out! Selfie time! <laughs> oh, what just happened? It looks like Katie sent you your first text. Hmm. Cool. What are all these faces? And why is one <laughs> sticking its tongue out? They're called emoticons. <laughs> They're like a language. See the smile, Grandma? Katie is just letting you know that she's in a good mood. So now you're gonna know all about text messaging. Are you going to respond? Of course I'll respond. Now where are the smiley faces? Aha! Hmm. <gasps> Grandma, what are those strange symbols you sent me? What do you mean? She's the one who sent them first. From now on. When I need to say something, I won't use words. I'll only use the smiley faces. Well, you look at this. It's high time someone removes these from the road. Save water. Don't let it drip all day. This wall needs a paint job. Last but not least, please water. Let's see if all these emoji cans will do the trick. <sighs> Hot. Want to go to the lake? Huh? Ah. <laughs> go, go, Turbozoars! Take a detour! Hold it! What's all this? Let's see. Why are there pictures on these rocks? That's weird. There weren't any yesterday. <laughs> Do you think it's a message? If so, the message is that someone wants these stones dug out. That's right. I bet that someone wants these stones to be dug out so they can be cleared from the road. Who's this someone? Maybe that's their symbol. It looks like a broken dumbbell. Maybe a retired athlete. Do you think we can dig out the stones and move them? Are you kidding? Of course we can. All that's left is to decide where to put them. How about we take them to the lake? We're heading there anyhow. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> Another message. Our mystery person strikes again. One's got a shovel. Do you dig it? And the other has some kind of broom. Let's go there.
Hey, look! I'm a gardener now! Stop! Those are roots! This tree's upside down! Much better! That's done! Some water, please! That ought to do it! We did lots of important chores. Those messages were useful. What? Grandma just sent me a message. What does it mean? She wants us to weed the new trees. Look! It's a broken dumbbell. So, all those notes we found. I wonder, were they from her? Good point. They, they were, were all from Grandma. Grandma. They couldn't have been meant for us. So then who were they meant for? Let's ask her. <laughs> oh, what's this? Dinosaurs? What is going on over there? Huh? Peter? Dinosaurs? A new emoticon. <laughs> Help! Huh? He's been taken. He's gone. Kidnapped. Huh? Now hold on, just start over. Why are you panicking? And who's taken? Thor! They took him to the city. Here's how it went down. This trail makes me kind of nervous. The highway's right there. What if someone sees us? Huh? What the? <laughs> <laughs> Greetings. My name's Thor, and this here is Unky. What brings you to these parts? He's not a real dino. Probably made of plaster and wood. Huh? Hmm? Ah! Uh. Uh -huh. It's over here, right? Uh -huh. Somewhere. Ah, uh, there. He didn't hear the humans in time, so he didn't manage to turn into a car. He just froze in place, and they thought he was the fake dinosaur they made. I still don't understand. How did that lead him to getting taken? When they mistook him for the fake dinosaur we saw earlier, they took him to the city instead. Apparently, they're building a dinosaur theme park downtown and one of the statues fell out of the truck. They think mm. Thor is that statue. He's all alone and he could be in danger. <gasps> well, guess we don't have a choice. We'll have to bail him out. Huh? <laughs> go, go, Turbozors! and check things out. And you guys can wait for us in the park. They've been gone a while. <laughs> You know, real dinosaurs didn't look anything like this model. Right? It's all wrong. Huh? Over there! <laughs> ah, you guys made it to the park opening? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's so boring. None of these dinosaurs look real. They should be scary. Look at this one. <laughs> or these. Huh? <laughs> boring. <laughs> Just people in costumes. Let's bounce, Bruno. <laughs> Ah, you're here. I don't know how much longer I can last. It's been two hours since I ate. Can you step off the rock? I can't. They put me in cement. Don't worry. Nothing's impossible. I've got a plan. So here's Thor, and here's us. Unky, can you pick up Chuck and truck for him and lift him up and over? That way he can dislodge Thor. Should be able to. Then it's settled. Tonight, Thor will get swapped out with the fake dinosaur from the forest. Which is where, exactly? We need it here. I remember where we found it. I'll take you there. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, uh. 
Unky, did you forget where it is? I did not. I'm just having trouble remembering. Quiet! Mm -hmm. Someone's over there. Hmm. <sighs> I found something very suspicious. Come with me, children. I found proof dinosaurs live here. I present a specimen. Uh, that's not a real dinosaur. That's a statue, uh. Mr. Charlie. Huh? I guess. Oh, well, I only thought... Uh. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Bull, make hmm? sure the ground stays hmm? level for Unky. Then Unky brings over Chuck. Then he'll get Thor's feet unstuck. We'll need to get it done quickly and quietly. So Unky brings the fake over the fence. Then we put the fake on the cement and everyone gets back over safe and sound. Mm -hmm. Go, go, Turbozars! Great idea for a park. Maybe I'll come back sometime. Well, have fun with that. I've had quite enough of this place for a lifetime. <laughs> Thanks for the jailbreak. Let's not do this again. <laughs> Sensational. Tourists report a large scary animal in the forest near our city. The animal appeared to be a dinosaur. Nonsense, the things they come up with. But just in case, I suppose it can't hurt to ask your dad and some of his friends to go to the forest and take a look for this unknown animal. We gotta go warn the Turbozors. Thanks for breakfast. Thanks a bunch, Grandma. Oh, huh? you're staying here with me, Florian. You need to finish your breakfast. They're not here. You think they were found? Dad couldn't get here that fast. Hi. <gasps> there you are. We've been looking for you. You've all got to split. What's going on? People saw you here and think you're dangerous. And now they're coming to find you, so you've got to leave the forest. We can't just leave. This is our home. We've lived here thousands of years. Yeah. yeah. What if we explain that these dinosaurs aren't dangerous? But who would believe us? We won't be allowed to come here again. People must never know we're here. We've hid a long time, and it's important that we continue to hide. I got it. We'll make it seem like it was all a big mistake by building a toy dinosaur. But what adult would be afraid of a toy? We just need people to think the report was a mistake. Peter, I think you just had a terrific idea. Does anyone else think that this creature might not be scary enough? Or am I the only one with doubts? Uh, what don't you uh... like about it, Chuck? To me, it looks like it's some innocent little animal. I bet if we made it out of rubber, then it could be somebody's bath toy. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to try something different? We should make a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Why is that? Yeah, why is that? Same question. Hey, check out the Tyrannosaurus. <laughs> it's beautiful. And now, we have to make it look terrible. La, 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 la. One last thing. What will we use to build it? Hmm. Well... Oh! The wind knocked these down. If we look around, we'll find more. We are in a forest. Great idea! Let's do it! Huh, made of fallen trees! <laughs> go, go, Turbozors!
could help everybody by being a bottle. <laughs> Looks just like this. Hey, you ruined it! Shoes! <laughs> <laughs> Terrible beast found in the forest, standing absolutely still. Someone makes a wooden sculpture in the forest and tourists mistake it for a live dinosaur. Your dad and his friends decided to bring it to town and put it on display in the square. We should all go see it. Wasn't me. My ball didn't hit those flowers. Look, there are footprints. Must have been some animal here who crushed them with his feet. <gasps> Hello. We didn't know you had a cat. <clears throat> he's not mine. He lives on his own. So if he's done anything wrong, it's not my fault. What's his name? How should I know? I call him Kitty, or Snow Leopard. Kids, it's time to eat now. I'm all done. Everything tasted great. Grandma, can we help you wash the dishes? Oh, no thank you. We'll wait for hot water to come back. Go have fun. Kitty! Here, kitty! What happened? The cat is gone. Maybe he moved on. I kind of liked having him around. <sighs> Poor thing's probably far away by now. I don't think we'll ever find him. Kitty! Don't give up hope so soon. See? Look here. Aren't those his tracks? We can follow them. I know who can help us. <laughs> and now he's lost. Sounds like a pickle. We'll go find that cat. Jerry? One step ahead of you, Bull. <laughs> Target spotted nearby. Follow me. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Here, kitty. <laughs> Looks like he doesn't trust us. Go, go, Turbozors! Chuck, can you reach up there? He's scared. What do we do now? I have an idea. What if we make a ladder? Watch. Thor, make a base for the stairs. Joe, we'll need lots of timber for this. Unky, go help. Chuck, you can split the logs for the ladder rungs. Wait, safety first. Hey, look, 
lucky I have this rope. Jerry, fix the rope. <laughs> Whoa, what? What's that? Oh, I think I know. It's new pipes for the water system. That's why Grandma had no hot water. Oh no, come back. Kitty? Kitty! Well, don't just stand there, Peter. Call the dinosaurs. As luck would have it, we need your help again. I see. Kitty's at it again. We'll need to be careful with this one, team. Chuck, you look into every pipe. If there's no cat, we'll need to put it very carefully into the trench. Unky, help us put the pipes in the ground. Thor, dig away. What should we do? You guys have the most important job, making sure the cat doesn't run away once we find it. You guys really fixed the pipes. Now Grandma can have hot water again. We found your cat. Here he is. Kitty, you're home. Oh, thank you, kids. What a naughty boy running away. Home is where the heart is. Right, cat? Of course. This can be your home now. Alright, I'll be back in three days. Now while I'm gone, it's important that you're all good for Aunt Nora, okay? Mm-hmm. Huh? Uh, uh. Huh? Oh, there's my bus. I've gotta go now so I can catch the train. Someone forgot their suitcase. Huh? Ah. That suitcase belongs to Grandma. She got on the bus without it. Yes, a sticky situation. Don't you worry about it. I'll get the other turbozors and we'll think of something. And then Grandma forgot her bag, along with everything in it. Oh, me too. Even though I was hungry, I somehow managed to forget breakfast and... Thor is a perfectly lovely story, but we just don't have the time. According to this map, we can catch the train at the next stop and bring your grandma her suitcase. The only problem is that stop is all the way on the other side of the river. I know what we can do. Turbozors to the river. Here, we will build a ramp and jump right over the river. Thor, you start digging a hole. Unky, you start looking for the materials. Mm -hmm. <laughs> go, go, Turbozoids!
Katie, Peter, get in. And be sure to hang on to your hats. Your grandma needs her suitcase. <laughs> Who knew Joe can fly? <gasps> Wait a minute! I can fly! Mm -hmm. To the grandma I go! Mm -hmm. Maybe you should have forgotten to have breakfast yesterday as well. <laughs> Do you have to drive so fast? You have to keep up, Jerry. We can't be late. Oh, maybe your grandma can do without her case. Jerry, if you're tired, just ride on the roof. What on earth are you waiting for? Step on it, Joe! Grandma needs her suitcase! Hold on tight, because the road might get a little bumpy from here. I'm not worried. How bumpy can it be? You're about to find out! <laughs> Jerry, you can open your eyes now. We've stopped moving. But we can't stop moving. We're already running late. I think we just might make it if we can get up over the mountain. That's a waste of time. Why not just go through the tunnel? We can't go in the tunnel. The sign says so. Imagine being scared of a tunnel. Well, I'm going in myself. <gasps> I told you there was nothing to worry about. Hey, what's that light up ahead? Huh? It's the train. The train! The train! Yeah, I think we should go up the hill. Oh. <laughs> Peter? Katie? My suitcase! How on earth did you get here so quickly? A special driverless taxi. Oh. It's oh. very fast. Without it, we never would have made it. Thank you for the suitcase, kids. So what would I ever do without you? <laughs> Bye. And now it's time to go home. But please, can we drive home the long way? <laughs> <laughs> Is. But that's not fair. If I hadn't sneezed, I could have stayed up there a year before you found me. Oh, come on. When I'm it, the tree is the first place I look. That's because there's nowhere else to hide in the yard. If we played in the woods, I could hide anywhere. You know Aunt Nora won't let us play in the woods. There's nothing wrong with right here. Peter, you're it. One, two, three, four, five. I don't understand. How far could he go? He could have gone into the woods. Remember, he said he could hide anywhere in there. I'm not afraid. It's a piece of cake. Boris, are you sure that you want to go in there by yourself? He's my brother, and I'm going to find him. Somebody help me. Something. And we will, with the Turbozor's help. You've never looked better. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh? 
Guys, huh? we really need your help. Our friends are lost in the woods. Now don't you panic. Ow! Jerry flies to the rescue. Well, I didn't know the woods would be such a big place. I'm tired and so hungry. You're not the only one. So thirsty, too. And I don't know if anyone's ever going to find us. I found them, but it's not going to be easy to get to them because on one side is the marsh, and on the other, the gorge. We'll find a way over the gorge. Wow, that is a big gorge. What do we do? You always say that nothing's impossible, so there must be a way over. You see that fallen tree? We're going to turn it into a bridge and get to the other side. Go, go, Turbozors! Thor, you prepare the ground so we can build a bridge. Unky, you go get the tree and hand it over to Chuck. And Chuck, get that tree to the other side of the gorge. I've been working out a lot lately. And how are we going to get across now? I have an idea. What if we build a full-fledged bridge, just like this? Even better, we'll build the bridge on stilts. A bridge, bridge on, on stilts? stilts. What's, What's better, better than, than that? that? Jerry and Chuck, go look for more tree trunks. Bull, bring those trunks over here. Thor, go get some more ground ready so we can build our bridge. <laughs> to go across. You just let Chuck take care of that. Now we need planks for the bridge itself. Unky, pass the logs to Chuck. He'll cut them into boards and we'll make ourselves a bridge. Don't wake them up. I have an idea. But we're gonna need a sturdy car. <sighs> What's keeping the boys? It's so late. Where have they gone off to? Have you seen the boys? Nothing to worry about. They were hiding, and we searched and searched, and eventually, we found them. Bruno. Boris, you can't sleep on the ground. You'll catch a cold. Where's the swamp? And where's the terrible forest? Uh, just a dream. Let's go. The cake is ready. And bring your friends, because friends are very important. Sleep again? <laughs> We're heading to the city. Would you like to join us? <laughs> A trip to the city? I've never been there before. They say it never sleeps, you know. I'm sorry, Chuck, but you can't go to the city. You're simply too big. Big and rather toothy. <laughs> I might have an idea. Nothing is impossible. If Chuck pretends he's part of the dinosaur exhibit at the museum, then he can come with us. Hooray! I'm gonna be a museum exhibit. Ah. <laughs> 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 
no, no, no. Mm. <laughs> 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 oh, I'm tired. Chuck, maybe until we reach the city, you can drive yourself? Chuck is busy. He's rehearsing for his debut role. Carry on. Uh, uh, something like this? Or like I'm running? No, it won't work. Your eyes are expressionless. Uh, uh, you can go further. We don't have all day. Look, I can see a car wash. If there's nobody there, you can get something to drink. Oh, oh I am hot. What I wouldn't give for some refreshing swamp water. Huh? Oh. <laughs> it tickles. Oh, oh, it tickles. <laughs> Yup, it tastes fine, but a little too much soap. And here on our right, we have the neighborhood grocery store. And on the left is the post office. And that is a traffic light. Post H. Traffic light. Thank you so much. I would never have seen any of this without you. Keep quiet. <laughs> Looks like they're building a new wing. Here's the museum, but I forgot, today is Sunday. Sorry, guys, but the museum is closed. Uh. <sighs> Exhibit for Dinosaur Museum. Do not touch. <laughs> Maybe he's afraid of getting tickled. Well, actually, I'm not afraid of anything. <laughs> 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 Oh, please forgive me. I forgot to be quiet. It's disgraceful! <laughs> Talking artifacts that attack innocent people. I'm going to complain about this. Only first, you had better get me out of here. Anki, we need your help, please. There's nobody driving, but the crane is moving. Something strange is going on. Oh, the crane is going to fall over. We're not going to let that happen. Unky, see if you can hook it. Thor, get supports. Chuck, make sure it doesn't fall. Jerry, keep an eye on the load. Go, go, Turbo Zords! Thanks for looking out for me, Jerry. Turbozors, we go on three. All together. One, two, three! A job well done, Turbozors. Time to go home. I'm pretty thirsty again. You think they still have water at the car wash? <laughs> <laughs> that tickles. Oh, that tickles. <laughs> 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 